Well, we may be in for a COVID Christmas, but there's no skipping presents in a pandemic. Our nonprofit friends are especially in need. CBS 2's Lauren Victory shares some major changes Chicago charities are making this season. Our whole world just came crashing down. Sharing the touching stories of patients and their families. I end up like fainting at school. Is not a new tactic for the Lurie Children's Hospital of Chicago Foundation. But senior gift officer Aaron Kahn needs to tug especially hard at heartstrings this year. We didn't see a huge um, decrease in terms of fundraising, um, but we did see an increase in need. The foundation's upcoming fundraiser, Radiothon, will be missing its huge phone bank that usually hypes up listeners. And a lot of our volunteers are going to be doing you know, virtual cheering sessions for people that are donating. How long would you say that you've been prepping for this holiday season? Probably early April, we started to have in the back of our minds, what if this goes into the Christmas season? Major Caleb Sen is from the Salvation Army, another charity forced to change its biggest fundraiser, the Red Kettle Campaign. Mobile pay was introduced in 2019, and with donations expected to be down as much as half, this is a very safe way to give. 2020 is all about promoting the touchless option using newly designed signs. So when the donor passes a Red Kettle, they see that QR code front and center. Uh, so they've got their phone available. Take a quick picture. It brings you right to our giving site. At Ronald McDonald House Charities of Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana, no more surprise donations. So many of our children have immune system um, vulnerabilities. Food and cleaning supplies, not books or toys, are on their Amazon wish list. Our number one need is meals and catered meals and gift cards related to that. That's because volunteers normally prep food, but that service is canceled until further notice. We have always welcomed the generosity of the community. It just looks different this year, like most other things. Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. And don't forget this Tuesday, our CBS Chicago Cares annual day of giving. We have teamed up again with Red Cross to bring you stories of hope. You'll see those stories here on CBS2 and on our digital streaming network, CBSN Chicago.